so today I am filming another DIY. I really didn't think this was gonna happen, but here we are. So it's going to be like a wall decor type of thing, and it's gonna have a quote. And this time I'm having my mom help me because this is actually going in my room. So it actually needs to look good. You're gonna need a shadow box. This one is a 11 by 14, I believe. I wanted a 16 by 20, but they did not have one. Then I have stencils for the words, paint, paint brushes, and this pre-cut board of whatever color you would like. I'm doing Tiffany blue because that is the color in my room. So let's get started. Okay, first off, I literally hate recording voiceovers, but whatever. So you're gonna start with cutting the stencils. You wanna just cut them so it's just the letter. It makes it a lot easier. You're gonna place it down and use your little sponge to put the paint. Now you have to make sure the letter is backwards so when you're looking at it from the outside, you're reading it correctly. This I know. This I know. Hear a knock on the door and the night begins how hard I'm trying Cause we've done this before so you come on in I want you all to myself Make yourself at my home, tell me where you've been You're looking for a good change Pour yourself something cold, baby, cheers to this So come on, give me a So now I was doing it by myself and I found it hard to pick up the letters after I put the paint. So what I was doing was actually putting tape on the stencils, it made it a lot easier to lift so there was no mistakes and nothing to smudge. Then once I did make a smudge the mistake, I was just taking a q-tip and cleaning around the edges and you can also add some alcohol on the q-tip but I explain that a little bit later. It was in this moment that I realized I spelt everything wrong. <laughs> I can't believe I actually did that. So I ended up just continuing with the rest of the project and having to erase the entire word, everything, which is how I spelt it. So I had to erase that and then I just continued with the rest and did the whole thing over again. Okay, now basically I've been doing this for a very long time now. Um, I took a break and now I'm doing it again. It's basically just taking the stencil and doing each letter. So I'm on the word happens right now. We're almost there. And yeah, it's pretty much it. What I've been doing is every single time I mess up, which is a lot, I just take a Q-tip and go around and then I use rubbing alcohol and it comes off perfect. I'm using acrylic paint, so yeah. Okay, fast forward actually a few weeks and it is done. This is the finished product. Um, I am so sorry I did not film an outro. I moved into my new apartment. So look forward to an apartment tour pretty soon, but yeah, that's pretty much it. If you love DIYs, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe for new videos every Wednesday. Thanks, guys. Green like Jamaican flag.